Good day Junkers, picked this up at my favourite shop, good old two dollars, it's a classic thermo cooler for a car, 12 volts, a bit dirty but if it works it does the job, well it does work, I have tested it. Obviously you have a nice beefy 12 volt lead. There you go. Nice little fuse in there. And I believe there's just four screws. But you never know. Interesting. Okay, so I don't know if you know how these work. And part of it I'm guessing. But this is a large aluminium fin. This is a fan. On the inside there is a small piece of metal. They are thermally bonded, usually with a bit of thermal paste. Um, so I won't take that apart, even though I do have thermal paste to correct it. But basically, this fan, 12 volts, the fan moves. It basically cools this large area which means this small area inside here gets cold, duh, than this gets. So it basically removes the heat from inside. Obviously when you're actually using it, you put cold stuff in because it's uh, not very efficient. Well, it's efficient because you've only got a fan, but if you switch it into heat, I believe, don't quote me on this, that's what these letter uh, leads are for, and inside there, there is actually a very small heating element, so that would keep things warm. So, that's basically it, very simple, and we've just got a bit of a, probably a protection diode in there, don't know if you can see, don't quite know how they manage Ah. We can pull this. Yes, there we go. So, yeah, three position switch. Um, quite a few diodes in there. LED resistor to bring down the voltage of the LED. Another LED. Not sure what the diodes are for. If someone in the comments can tell me, that'd be good. Otherwise, very simple. And I'll see you next time. Bye.